Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Panto6 and today I want to go into a little bit more depth on what Bits and Pieces is and also where the money is that gets donated is going to go to. Now the reason why I'm doing this is because I had a comment on one of my videos about pretty much that and they said you know they would recommend that I disclose pretty much every bit of money that will be going towards this, that, that, and that. Now, first and foremost, whenever you start a business and you try to get a loan, chances are they're going to ask you how much money you have. And I have already told them that, which I have zero dollars. Um, and they said they, you need at least three to four thousand dollars for a <clears throat> goodwill um, expense, basically. And so that's what I'm trying to do there. So the money we get to cover that will definitely go towards the goodwill part. Now, the other thing is finding a building, renting the building, paying the deposit, paying the utilities, paying for furniture as well as cash registers, uh, decorations, um, you know, third party vendors, as well as other things. But you do have to have merchandise. So I would imagine we'd have to call you know, Wizards of the Coast, uh, Nintendo, I believe, for the Pokemon stuff. Um, we'd have to buy consoles, uh, PCs, uh, televisions, um, and stuff like that for the gaming tournaments. Um, you know, f also for uh, movie nights, uh, board games, um, Friday Night Magic drafts, and stuff like that. So a lot of money is going to go towards that so we have to pay the vendors or the companies to get that merchandise in our store then we got to talk about advertising so I do a lot of advertising right now via social media and I also went through uh, the surrounding areas I printed out flyers and hung them out in local businesses um, around this area so in Terre Haute, Marshall, Casey, uh, see, Martinsville um, Charleston, Mattoon, and I don't know, next week we're going to go to Paris and Effingham and hang up some more stuff like that, some flyers. And I do apologize, I am, I don't feel good right now. I've got that, I got a hiatal hernia, and I got acid reflux, and it sucks. So, I'm like choking a little bit, so. But the other things we need to worry about is getting licenses. Um, if we want to serve food, we do have to have a license of some sort. So, even though the food we'll be serving is things like cold sandwiches, um, maybe something to heat them up, like a toaster, um, the meats, the cheeses, the breads, the soups, um, and stuff like that. And we need to get tables and chairs, um, as well as you know utensils, uh, plates, bowls, cups, and a vin like a fountain drink dispenser and stuff like that. Um, now all this is going to add up. It's going to hit really, really quick. And we would have to start these things. It's going to get really, it's going to be a slow start at first. But also we have to um, get, like I said, advertise. So we'd have to put ads in the newspaper, radio, um, try to do more social media. Like I said, I, I spent a lot of time advertising this on social media and I'm sure you guys are getting tired of talking about it. And like I said, it's it's really awesome. I don't expect you guys to donate, but uh, if you guys can just share, help me get the word out on it because um, it's it's been almost three weeks. We've had a few donations, but we haven't really got anything. Uh, substantial yet and I, I just don't want to get my hopes on this because this is not just for me uh, this is for me uh, my fiance my friends my family gamers non-gamers people that suffer with anxiety depression people that are abused hungry um, anything like that so that's the main reason I'm wanting to do this because not only is it going to help me out help gamers out but it's also going to help people that have serious issues um, and we have to do things like drives, food drives, clothing, uh, backpacks, 
um, anything that people need would like to provide. Now, we'll also be selling things, comic books, board games, card games, some video games. We'll also have events like pay-per-view matches like UFC, uh, <laughs> wrestling, and we'll also have movie nights. So that's a cool thing, too. So I was thinking about getting a projector. Um, that way we can watch you know, a bunch of movies and vote and stuff like that. Now, this is going to help get things started. Uh, it's going to help. We'd have to get insurance on the company. Um, and we'd have to get you know the patents, I believe, or copyright. I don't know how it works, but there's a lot to it. There's a lot of legal fees. Um, and I want to disclose pretty much everything to you guys. It's from the decorations to the you know last cup we have to buy. I want to make this work. I just want to tell you guys that the money that we make from this is going into this. Now, once it becomes more successful, you know, it will help out. We can hire people. Um, we can do more things. Um, maybe have late night lock-ins. Um, pizza parties, and you name it. Um, I mean, of course, it's a business, so we, you know, we will have to make money, but it's that's just to take care of me and my family but the rest of the money a lot of the money is also going to go towards helping people out so maybe getting a counselor a full-time counselor to come in and you know or just anything I like I said I really want this to work out um, I think it's going to be really great um, I'm really passionate for it I want it I want it so bad and I want to make a difference in the gaming community as well as community around here and like I said a smile goes a long way from the first person who walks in that door and needs help and they need somebody to talk to my goal is to help them out and show them that we actually care that's the goal of this that's the whole goal of bits and pieces when you look at bits and pieces and you see this subtext come together that's everybody from whatever nationality uh, <laughs> gender, uh, race, sexual orientation, religion, whatever. Everybody is together on this. We help each other. We take care of each other. We help the people that's in need. And we try to stop bad things from happening. As somebody that suffers with depression, I know exactly how it feels and how hard it is to come out and talk to somebody and feel like they are safe in a great environment. And that's the plan, is to help these people out with whatever they need. And if we can make somebody smile, that's awesome. That's really awesome. Now, that's what I really want to happen. And like I said, um, if this thing takes off, this is for all of us. This is for all the gamers. This is for all of us. We will make our mark. We'll show, you know, gamers not, are not just all bad trolls or, you know, lazy people. We ha actually have something we want to work for. We want to care. And hopefully it'll help. And maybe once we get things uh, taken off, we can get special guests, maybe YouTubers. Who knows? Maybe I can talk Boogie, Boogie two nine eight eight, to come in. That would be amazing. Um, but that, it, it's I just don't want you guys to think that this is some kind of fraud because you know anybody can make a, a GoFundMe or Kickstarter and pull away last minute or just take all that money and spend it on shit. Um, that's not the case here. This is something that I'm really passionate about. I want to help out. And I'd love to make my mark in the gaming industry or the community. So, guys, thank you so much for checking us out. You can go to www.gofundme.com forward slash bits and pieces. Again, I'm not making you donate. I don't care if you do or not. I mean, I care, but I, I'm not making you do that. Um, but if you do, I highly appreciate it. But if you don't donate... Maybe you can share it on your Facebook, tell your friends about it, Twitter, YouTube, Instagram, whatever. And like I said, I definitely appreciate every single bit of 
any help, any help necessary. And if you're somebody from the game industry that has ideas, or if you want to donate, even if it's not money, or if it's maybe, I don't know, games, books, uh, controllers, headsets, whatever, if you want to help out with that, feel free to contact me. I would definitely appreciate any type of help. If it's t-shirts, whatever, lanyards, stickers, that would be amazing because everything is going to go to something. And the more stuff we have, the better. The better we can do with it. But guys, thank you so much. I love you all. I hope that explains a little bit more. I'm sorry I'm kind of like... I always stutter. You guys know that. You watch all my videos. You know I kind of bounce from <laughs> one thing to the next. And that's just, that's just me. That's just me. Maybe it's something I'll get used to. But um, I want to make sure you guys know me for me and not the fake me. So, again, I love you guys. Be sure to hit like and subscribe and share. I love you. See ya.